Assalamualaikum. Welcome to Farm and Form. And today in this video, we will discuss how to calculate bulk density of the tablet. One of the most important question related to this video is that why we need to calculate the bulk density of the tablet. Mean why we have to calculate the bulk density of the tablets. We are familiar that we calculate the bulk density of powders to calculate the capacity of our blenders. In the same way, we have to calculate the bulk density of our tablets to calculate the capacity of our tablet coating pans. Mean to determine that how much weight of the tablets can be coated in a tablet coating pan, we have to calculate the bulk density of the tablets. So let's start our video. As you are familiar that the formula of bulk density is equal to D is equal to M over V, M is equal to mass and V is equal to volume. So to calculate this we need two things. One is the weight and second one is the volume. For this we will take any measuring cylinder and add a specified weight of the tablet into it and we'll check that how much volume is occupied by these tablets. Mean Suppose we have a measuring cylinder and we add 50 grams of the tablets into the cylinder and they occupy the volume of the 60 ml. Mean mass is equal to 50 gram and volume is equal to 60 ml. We will calculate bulk density by the formula mass over volume 50 over 60 is equal to 0 0.833 gram per ml. The bulk density of the tablets is dependent on the weight of the tablet and the shape of the tablet. Suppose this value is for the round shape small tablets and when we will add the oblong shape large weight tablet in the measuring cylinder the more volume will be occupied. Let's take the example. Suppose we add the 50 gram weight of the oblong shaped tablet and they occupy the volume of the 80 ml. Mean in the round shape small tablets void spaces are covered up more precisely as compared to the large size tablets. So in case of the large size tablets our density will be equal to the 50 over 80 is equal to 0 0.625 gram per ml. So in this way you can calculate the bulk density of your tablets and then later on can use this bulk density of tablets for the capacity calculation of the tablet coating pan. I hope you are now familiar with this calculation and if you like the video share it to others and do subscribe my channel. Till the next video, Allah Hafiz.